Hey, what's going on, everybody? I was just going through some of my stack this morning and uh, came across these uh, coins that I don't think I ever made a video on, so I'm going to make a video on them now. Um, when I bought these, I wasn't doing YouTube videos at the time. Um, so, I'm going to take the opportunity to make a video on these now. I think these are a couple of the coolest coins um, that have ever come out. These were minted by um, the Scottsdale Mint. And they kind of have the same um, feel as like Port Silver, but they're coins. I'm going to show you what these are. These are the um, King Tut um, Egyptian uh, series. The COAs are on the box, sort of. Egyptian Relic Series King Tut Coin Republic of Chad, 5 Troy Ounces. And they were uh, minted by the Scottsdale Mint. So I'm going to take one out. And as you can see, I mean, they're antiqued. They're a really thick coin. And I mean, you don't really have to worry about gloves with these. Is what I kind of like about these, this particular coin. Um, I mean, you can, I mean, if you wanted to, you could probably even use this thing for like a paperweight, you know. Um, but... Thing is really thick antiqued um, and what I mean by it's almost has a feel of like poor silver is you can touch it you can throw it around shuffle it in your hands and not have to worry about spotting or condition because I mean it's uh, it is what it is right um, but it's an awesome piece and I was looking to see I might pick up a few more of these I have a total of three, so 15 Troy ounces, um, and they're still on like Atmex. I haven't checked other sites for uh, 599 over spot. These have a mintage of 30,000. So with these, these were released like I think early or mid 2016. So I can't believe with this low mintage um, that they're still available so cheap. Um, so I think I'm gonna and I think these are good for not only collectors I think these are good for collectors and for stackers alike because the uh, Premiums are not super high for a coin that has a limited mintage of only 30,000 um, the Premiums aren't super high and especially since they've been out for uh, well over a year I would have thought that they would have uh, increased in value or um, I would have thought that they would have increased in value by now but even if they're you know not as super collectible even if they never appreciate to what they probably should I mean it's still a really cool piece that doesn't require a, that's not going for a super high premium I mean six bucks is you know high enough but um, I think it's a really a really interesting unique uh, piece that I think deserves a spot in pretty much everybody's stack um, rather you're a collector or a, uh, a stacker so all right thanks a lot everybody for watching please like comment and subscribe